be very quiet. I'm hunting rabbits. So I'm working on two guitars at the same time. That one and that one. They'll be in separate repair videos. This guitar is a funky guitar. And the one thing that I... Oh, you can't hardly see it, but... Right? That's a crack. So... Bummer. Anyway, the uh, silk screen is worn off here. It's okay. Um, it's a funky unit. The, uh, Headstock. It was broken. This is just nothing here, but it's got two dowels in it. And doweling is one of my specialties. Um, anyway, whoever fixed it put two pins in it and it's well glued. So I'm going to make it, but you can see the repair, it's just obviously, and it was all dented. So, I'm starting to fix it. So, um, as I said, this has been repaired, which is, I'm going to make this disappear. You probably would never be able to see it was broken. This is going to get refinished, and here, um, it was loose here, but not here. So I broke this loose, that allowed me to change the neck angle and re-glue this. It's cheating, but I mean, it's an old funky guitar, it's called, I think it's called Slipping the Heel. Um, anyway, um, when you do that, this widens a little bit, so I have a little work to do here. It's nothing for me. And uh, the neck is really straight. There's plenty of frets left, but it's funky as to. It's just all kind of old and is the original wooden nut. Um, technically this guitar was originally a lap steel guitar because there's no compensation in the saddle. There's no compensation and uh, I believe it was made as a lap steel guitar. There's also no bracing. The only brace is the bridge plate it's here. So I put crazy glue on all the frets. I'm, uh, they were a little loose in their slots. They're a hundred years old, so they're level. Or they will be soon. So we Reset the neck angle by uh, slipping the heel, as they say. I broke this loose beforehand, re-glued it. And you can see how it worked. Before, it was an eighth inch off the top. This is a full three-eighths, and we're right there at the top of it right at the top, which is where we're supposed to be. So, this is absolutely flat and straight. This is three thousandths of an inch thick. That's a little thinner than a sheet of paper. These are your eyes. My eyes. This is three again, so. Thank you.
can have some dry threads right there. And this first thread is high, which we knew. And I'll be taking out some of the uh, fret wear. I've already started. First fret is free. Second fret is not. You gotta take these down to get rid of the fret wear. So. It's called coplanarity. We are coplanar within plus or minus a thousandth of an inch. Disappear, and when I see they're gone at the top of this flat, the flat is gone, and I go to the next step. These are narrow and they're glass. So we're 
go down the whole neck. There's many of these that have virtually no divots. They just have crud on them. So it'll get easier, but it still work. Vibings. You get this at the cowboy shop. You can get it at Walmart. <laughs> Last time I looked. This you could use. This would work. Shouldn't have to shake it, I'm just doing it. Yeah, yeah. There may be a barrier. Yes. No barrier. Now it's left the actual seal. There we go. It's the actual seal. Where's my paintbrush? Mm. Is this handy? Here it is. It's called hide the paintbrush. All right. This is fun, that's all. And the astute watcher will see there's fret markers in here. I'm using dark brown because I ran out of black. <laughs> Gotta go to Walmart. It'll wipe off the frets. I'll put on a few coats. The dark brown has more red in it than the light brown. Poor K. Mantequilla. No. Parquet. That floors me. Yeah, yeah. So when we go down the neck, isn't this? Dab, dab, dab. You take your mighty brush and your mighty brown. Dab, dab. And that's not the curly haired guy, that's the guy with the accent and the mighty white. White on white or something like that, he calls it. But we also have our happy little frets. Happy little frets. Happy little fretboard. It's fun. There's some dust there. I missed. It's gonna. We're making it new again. Shut up. <laughs> Making anything, anything right now is something I don't want to hear. Because it sounds like something else. Meow, meow. This will also get some secret sauce. Some oil like oily bread, oily wines. It's darkening nicely, isn't it? This will take a couple of coats up here. But it's getting there. Happy little friends. Mm -hmm. We're almost done. Then I'll put in real pearl dots. We dye this thing again. Pretty good, not bad, I can't complain. back in a few minutes and wipe off the frets. <clears throat> we could do it now if we wanted. I think. Do we want? Mm -hmm. Completely wiped off, but 
<clears throat> you have essentially a new fretboard. It's been remanufactured. 